Welcome to Aston Martin Tampa Bay. My name is Mark Tillman and I'm the Aston Martin Brand Manager. Today we're hosting a VIP event for our Aston Martin customers and the rest of our ultra luxury customers. We will be supporting the TRG Race Team, which is Aston Martin Racing, and the Adobe Roads Winery for a VIP reception. The guests will get to intimately discuss with the drivers what they do on a daily basis and what their game plans are for race day. So I hope you enjoy. You'll see a lot of videos tonight and I think they'll all be fun. Tonight we're here at Aston Martin, Tampa Bay. Um, we're with two of the drivers for TRG Aston Martin Racing. Would you guys mind telling me a little bit about what's going on this weekend? So we're here at the uh, Firestone Grand Prix of St. Petersburg. It's our second stop of the season. Uh, Jason and I are doing kind of a unique program this year where we're co-driving in the Pirelli World Challenge, which nobody's really done that format yet. So it uh, puts a lot of pressure on us for things like qualifying yeah. and practice. We've got to share sessions and uh, just go get the most out of our weekend. So Jason's going to be starting the race tomorrow. I'll run the Saturday night race. Yeah. And uh, so my name is Jason Alexandridis. This is uh, co-driver Derek DeBoer. And again, we are sharing the car. Um, so today we had our uh, we had a very limited track time on the street course today. Uh, we had to share a very short qualifying session of 20 minutes. And uh, we had a, I think we did it pretty well. We, we cut the session in half. Uh, I was only able to get one flying lap. Uh, there's a red flag in my session. Derek uh, was able to get the, all of his, and so it's, these are kind of some of the challenges, but I was kind of thinking on the drive over to this event that, you know, it's, it's lucky to be able to do a full season, and that's, you know, it's going to make us that much a better driver as we go through, because we just have to get up to speed quicker with less laps. So, uh, looking forward to that challenge, actually. Shout out your watches, too, because they're cool. So, can you tell oh, yeah, us, can you tell us, would you mind, would you mind telling us a little bit about your sponsors that you guys have? Uh, we just have so much great support this year which is uh, a little different than last year. Last year my season was unraveling at this point due to some uh, people not doing what they said they were going to do so it's really forced us to go wrap our hands around the right people and, and find what real support looks like. So uh, BRM Chronographs is one of uh, my main supporters. Uh, they've created this custom bespoke piece. This is the Derek DeBoer watch. And uh, so I'm a little bit of a traveling watch salesman at each race event too. Each watch that sells helps our program. So, and then we also are raising money for Racing for Cancer. Uh, tonight we're auctioning off uh, two original art pieces of the car from last year and we have more pieces that will be worked on as the year goes on. Corrado de la Strada is a clothing company that helps us a lot and then Jason has a, a company, uh, Rebounders, yeah. that so, tell you about. So Rebounders in Rotor Park, California, it's a family entertainment center, trampoline park. Um, we've got a three-level three indoor playground, we've got a huge arcade, and what we actually do is we create a parents' lounge, a place for the parents to hang out, stadium surround sound, we've got uh, massage chairs, and we really take care of the parents so they can have their kids run for them up in there. So uh, very grateful to have the help of uh, Rebounders in Rotor Park and uh, looking to uh, expand on that effort uh, throughout the season. Would you mind telling us a little bit about this, uh, this car that's behind you here? Yeah, we're very lucky guys to get to be racing in the uh, Aston Martin V8 Vantage. About 450 horsepower, weighs in around 3,000 pounds, so it's a very, very potent car on the racetrack. Unlike a lot of things that we've both driven, it just doesn't have very many peaks or valleys. It just does everything really well, so we, we feel like we just have a really consistent platform throughout the season. Easy to drive, 
one of the sexiest and best sounding cars out there. Yeah. It really uh, it really flows uh, in the chicane and the S's pretty well, very well balanced. Uh, it's, it's a treat to drive. I'm Ashley Reynolds with Adobe Road Winery out of Sonoma, California, sister company of TRG Aston Martin Racing, and we are happy to be here to support the Dimmit dealership tonight with great wine, exciting race cars, and some awesome Aston Martin street cars. Hi, I'm Eric Shepard, Executive General Manager for Dimmit Automotive Group. We're having a wonderful evening with the Aston Martin race team here, and uh, it's just a wonderful time to celebrate the heritage that Aston Martin has with this fine automobile. Kevin, can you tell us what's going on this weekend, and uh, you know um, what's the status for the race cars? You bet. This weekend is the uh, St. Petersburg Grand Prix. The sports cars are running, and we're here with our Aston Martin team we're running three cars this weekend. One of the GT3s and two of the GT4s. But uh, the weekend starts with a we, we connect the dots between motorsports and lifestyle, and have a fun, you know, fantastic time doing that. We um, we love sort of the new paradigm of connecting uh, cool car guy and gal stuff along with motorsports and lifestyle. And of course, a little bit of food and wine thrown in for good measure. Um, we do own a small boutique winery called Adobe Road. It's uh, We're hot right now, I say that nicely. It took 15 years to be an overnight sensation. The last two things just took off. And again, that's kind of part of that whole lifestyle. Of boutique is in, small is in, unique is in. And um, we get to do something fun like this tonight here at Dimmit at the Aston Martin dealership. You know, we've got our friends from uh, Wells Fargo here tonight and a bunch of our sponsors and guests as well. And uh, got everyone here together having a good time. Uh, tomorrow at the race, big party tomorrow night at a friend's private penthouse, which is wonderful, and then Saturday and Sunday are going to be big, so looking forward to a great weekend. We broke out of the party to take a sneak peek at a very special Bentley. It's called a GT3, so stay tuned. We're gonna show you the car. A little behind the scenes look here. <laughs> have some, hopefully some fun. And uh, this one's a little different, a right-hand drive race car too. So something a little more unique here for us. I feel like we're committing a crime right now, but we're not because he's got a key. Come on. Oh my god, look at this. Wow. Look at this car. Yeah, you can see that this one's uh, been raised very well. Before. Slightly modified. I love uh, all the peeling stick. <laughs> This is amazing. Look at the uh, carbon fiber and then it's just built right in there. And Brembo brakes and racing slicks. And this thing's amazing. Look at look at all the buttons on the on the on the steering wheel. Left, right, ABS, page, map. Go ahead and I'll open up the door. neutral. can't really see it on the video from this, but this door is all carbon fiber and literally moves at the touch of a finger. Uh, just another little example of a few miles an hour of speed gained by shedding several pounds.